Do you have old clothes that you just don't want to wear anymore, but you don't have money to buy new clothes because of the virus? Well, here are some ways to spice up your outfits. Jenny, can I come in? Okay. For my video, I need you to pick four items, four or five items that are ugly, and I have to style them. We're in my old room right now, looking at the clothes I want to donate. <laughs> All the light we have. Yeah. <laughs> Ew. Uh. <laughs> no, wait. I don't, I don't know yet. Ew. I'll get back to you guys when she picks. But there's a lot of clothes out here, and it's kind of ugly. Okay, so my sister just looked at like the old clothes that we had um, and she picked four items for me to style and try to make look cute. So this is what we have. We have these like silk shorts. I honestly think this will be easy. Like I kind of have an idea already. And then these white shorts. This is going to be so hard because nobody wears like really short shorts that are like low rise like that is not that's not a cute look oh god and then we have this like skater dress that's black and then it has like a little back thing going on there i have no idea what i'm gonna do with this like i don't know <laughs> and then i have this it's like a button up and um it has this like rose patterning and I used to love this shirt so much, but now it's just so ugly to me. So we're gonna see what I can do with this. Challenge accepted. So like the light is like so trash in my room, but um, I'm going to go ahead and pick out my outfit for the first item of clothing. So we're gonna see how well I can do this. Honestly, I don't know because all the items are kind of ugly, but we'll give it a try. So for the first outfit, I turned these pink silk shorts that were very tiny on me into this little matching set. And I thought it turned out pretty cute, something I'd wear in the summer. There must be something bad. Okay, so this is outfit number one. I tried to go for like a matching set type of vibe. Like Honestly, these shorts were like so short. These shorts are not my size. I actually kind of like how this looks. At first, I was like, what the heck am I going to wear? But like, this is actually kind of cute. Like, I would wear this, like in the summer or something. Like, just around the house, you know? I would wear this fit. This is not that bad. It's really not. This is actually probably like the easiest item of clothing to pair. Like, it just keeps getting harder and harder. So, we're going we're gonna to try and see what we're going to do. to see so I took these white cargo looking shorts and I turned it into a beachy type of vacation-y outfit. Sorry that the light keeps changing because I literally have to close my blinds every single time I change because there's some creepy people out there. Okay, so this is outfit number two. These were these ugly shorts that do not fit because like they fit around my thighs, but then like these shorts, they literally don't fit though. Like I would never wear these out because I don't like how they fit on me because I'm wearing this like tank top, just some simple cami, you know, type of thing. And then I'm wearing this shirt I thrifted. I feel like you've guys seen it so much. It's like an iconic piece of mine, I feel like. But with these shorts, I was getting this kind of like vacation vibe from it, you know? So I decided to go with like, you know, a Hawaiian shirt. I don't know. I'll roll this up. It'll definitely like make myself look more put together. Yeah, that looks more put together because the sleeves are just so long. But yeah, I would wear this like vacationing in Brazil. This is like a rainforest type of look, you know, with a bucket hat. If I had a bucket hat, this fit would be fire. I'm just telling you guys. So I took this skater dress that I probably wore in middle school and I changed it into a completely new street style type of outfit. 
She got the posture of a superstar. I kind of snapped. Okay, so I know this like outfit looks a little bit basic, but like I'm wearing a dress, guys. The dress goes all the way down here. You can literally see lumps in my jeans because like I'm just trying to flatten out the freaking dress. Like Basically, I'm wearing the dress. It is like a little high neck and then it has like a little bit of an open back and it was like a skater dress and I tried like so many different things. I tried to put a shirt over the dress to make it look like I was just wearing a skirt, but I didn't really like the skater skirt vibe. I don't know. I felt like I was um, in middle school getting ready for a dance. I'm also wearing my Letterman jacket because I saw Madison Beer wear her Letterman jacket and hers was like really oversized and it looks so cute, but like mine isn't, mine is pretty big, so... I'm just using this. This is actually like literally my school letterman jacket, so. But yeah, I actually really like how this looks a lot. Like I'm really proud that I was able to style that dress. Like, it literally had no hope. Like I did not want to look like a middle schooler rolling out here. I already look young enough. <laughs> So I took this button up and I decided to tie it and pair it with a turtleneck and some jeans. Okay, this is the last outfit. I'm kind of tired of changing, I'm not gonna lie. But these vibes are like a little bit different. I feel like an artist. I'm gonna go pink. I don't know. And I really didn't like the um, embroideries. So I tried to cover it with like, you know, the collar and stuff just by folding it. And then I tied it. So it gave me a little bit of something else. This is a very different outfit. Like I still like it. I still respect it, you know. She's she's cute. Like this is not something I normally wear, but I would definitely like I would go out feeling confident, you know, like I don't like So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe because I make new videos every Monday. I had a lot of fun filming this, so definitely give it a thumbs up if you like more videos like this. And yeah, I'll see you all next week with a brand new video.